Dynamite Dome for what's shaping up to be one dandy of a matchup. I'm Brad Best, alongside A.J. Topper, live from the semifinals of the National Championship Beyblade Tournament. Oh, <laughs> you said a mouthful there, Brad. Hurry up, Tyson, we're late. We're gonna miss the standings. I hate to eat and run, especially at the same time. Whoa! Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to announce the standings. But first, let's meet an awesome competitor here by special invite. Please welcome Ray! Not this guy! Ray was flown in by tournament organizer Stan Dickinson himself, so this kid must really be something special. Well, he's got me psyched out, and I'm way up here in the booth. And now our semifinalists. First up, it's Max against current champion Kai. Then it's newcomer Tyson facing off against last minute challenger Ray. Oh, man. According to my stats, Ray's never been defeated. Never defeated, huh? Well, there's a first time for everything. Man, I didn't stand a chance. Whoa, he was good. I was toast. <laughs> hey, what's up? Just thinking, Chief. I sure hope you enjoy your visit, Ray. Because it's gonna be a short one if I can help it. Sounds like someone's getting a little overconfident. How cool is it that we both made it this far, Max? I know, it's awesome! You guys aced the early rounds. Now comes the hard part. That may be so, but I declare the final round will be... me versus Max. Right, just like we planned. After that, may the best man win. You're on. <laughs> Come on, guys! <laughs> oh, Max. Huh? This is for you. Oh, this was Grandma's pendant. She would want you to have it. It's good luck, son. Thanks. She always said this was special. Well, AJ looks like another packed house. And they're totally stoked for this match, too. You can feel the energy in the room. So, Max, if you win, the pizza's on you, right? Hey. Excuse me, but I have a match to win. Okay. He ain't so tough. I heard that. The crowd is going absolutely gonzo with anticipation. We're only moments away from kicking off the opening session. Max is using a defensive style Beyblade, which could render Kai's attack strategy totally useless. Good point, AJ, but I hope Max brought a sweater because Kai's one cool customer. And if he has a weakness, I haven't figured it out yet. And let's not forget that Kai's Bit Beast Dronzer could make all the difference in this match. Mondo correcto, dude. Hey, Max! You can do it! What do you think, Dizzy? Got any advice? Yeah. Never get trapped in a laptop. Oh, very funny, but I meant about the match. Oh, in that case, I'd advise that Max find a way to keep Bronzer out of the battle. Folks, today's featured battlefield is... The Tower Dish! Oh, Nelly, talk about throwing a wrench into the works. This changes everything. The idea here is to land your Beyblade in the tower dish. Sounds simple, but it takes mucho skill and concentration to pull it off. Seaside Dome isn't a Bay Stadium normally known for using the trick dish, so those two dudes must be totally bugging right about now. This will be a best of three battle. First player to stay in the tower for 10 seconds wins the session. So how the heck are we supposed to get it up there? That's impossible. It's just a matter of spin speed versus slope angle. Yeah, simple, really. Unless, of course, you're not a genius. Uh... Players, prepare for battle! I never thought I'd actually be standing here battling Kai. This one's for you, Grandma. The sooner we start, the sooner you are finished. <laughs> Welcome back to the Dome as today's match gets underway. Players, take your position! 
action. Get ready. Three, two, one. Let it rip. Oh, wow, look. He's using a new Beyblade. Let it rip. This battle is underway. It looks like neither competitor is wasting any time heading for the center tower. The race is most definitely on. Is in fine form, but watch out because Kai is looking to head him off at the pass. Wow! They're both totally clocking in some serious hang time here. No problem. Ah! Leave it to Max to turn an ugly backslide into a Bapo rebound that could land him square in the goal. I'll just have to take your word on that one. Amazing! I concur. Good thing I redesigned his Beyblade. Redesigned his Beyblade? Yup, with ball bearings. Pretty clever, huh? Placing one on each side improves balance and adds weight to the defensive. Plus, it gives it a little extra attitude, like me. Show them who's the boss, Max! Welcome to Collisionville, Population 2. Woo, he's about to break away! Max has totally found the dish, so he just needs to chill there for 10 seconds. Yes, this one's locked up! I wouldn't put this one to bed just yet, AJ, because Kai isn't about to roll over and go to sleep anytime soon. Huh? What's he up to? Now to separate the men from the boys. Bronzer, spin fire attack! Oh no! He's headed straight for Max! With a little help from Kai, Max has found a way to snatch defeat from the jaws of victory. Oh, no way! Eight, nine, ten! The first session is over and Kai has taken the lead! Not bad, kid. But without a bit feast of your own, you'll never be able to stand up to the power of my Dronzer. Ah, that's crazy! Max didn't stand a chance! Yeah. My defensive shield could have been a soap bubble for all the good it did. Kai is too powerful. Yo, Max! Remember, you promised that we'd meet in the tournament finals. And you better keep that promise, or else... You can do it, Max! I know it! He's right. I did make that promise to Tyson. And no matter what, I gotta keep it. I'm not sure how to compete against something as powerful as a bit beast, but that doesn't mean I'm going to back out now. There's got to be a way to defend against Kai's attack. Maybe I'm just going about it all backwards. That's it! Here we go! And it looks like the second session is set to get underway. Ready for more? I've never been more ready. Man, talk about being hungry for victory. That should do it. Ready and three, two, one. Let it rip! Whoa, Max just pulled a reverse launch. Hey, look at it go. Max been amped up his feet just enough to drop him right smack in the tower dish. Well, he's not wasting any time, that's for sure. Why would he make his Beyblade spin backwards? Um... There's about a million possible reasons. Maybe more. Yeah, like what? Dunno. Uh... I don't know what you're up to, Max, but it ends now. We now return you to the second session, already in progress. Come on, Kai. What are you waiting for? This time, I'm ready for you. If you were hoping to catch me off guard, then I'm afraid you'd come up short. Bronzer, spin fire attack! Here we go again! Oh, man! Better check the Richter scale, AJ, because that one shook the whole stadium. How about that? Somehow, Max was able to withstand Bronzer's attack. But at what cost? He's just a sitting duck waiting for Kai to roast him. Only time will tell, and time's just about up. I get it. 
Match releases Beyblade in the opposite direction to counter Kai's attack, thus allowing his Beyblade to absorb all of Dronzer's energy. So what now? That was a pretty clever stunt you pulled. But all you did was delay my victory. Dronzer, finish him off! Ha! You fell for it! Now, when I change my spin direction, I can use Dronzer's own power against him. How cool is that? Max's use of backspin is so ingenious. I'm surprised I didn't think of it myself. Yeah, that was awesome, yeah. Wow! I has just been booted from Dish Central. You might as well put a ribbon on it, because this session's all wrapped up. And the winner is... Max! Yes! It worked! It really worked! Uh-oh, this looks like trouble. Self-destructed! I guess it couldn't handle the massive energy overload! Even Humpty Dumpty wasn't in that many pieces! <gasps> no way! Where's all the king's horses and all the king's men when you really need them? How is Max ever going to be able to finish the match now? This can't be happening. I was so close! Tough break. And just when it was getting interesting... Well, well, Max, are, are you ready for the tiebreaker, or are you throwing in the towel? Uh, well, I'm not sure. Huh? There's something inside Grandma's pendant. Let's see. I remember this from when I was very young. Grandma said it was a symbol of great power called Drasil. I wonder if... Oh, wow, it fits! Grandma must have meant for me to find this. Drasil looks right at home in my Beyblade. What was that? Uh, Dragoon seems restless. I feel the same way. Dronzer seems to be acting strange all of a sudden. Must be psyched for battle. I don't know if you even have any power or not, but it would be totally cool if you could help me win this match. What do you say, Drasil? <sighs> so, I guess I'll take that as a yeah? Let's begin! Here we go again! Man, what a rush! Charge, cause we wanna hit a march. That's it! He's all yours! Oh no! I don't think Matt can keep this up! I have a hunch that help is on the way. Great, but still, don't forget, Kai's as powerful as they come. In like a hurricane, blowing everyone away. Pounding like thunder, we're gonna put them under. Here comes victory. Regulation time is up! We're headed for overtime! Taking them out with the Beyblade spinning On and on and just no quitting Beyblade just keeps on ripping Steady, Dronzer. You played the game well, but now it's time to end it once and for all. Dronzer, now! Ah! Okay. Don't panic, we can do this. Just a little longer. Hang on. Wait, what's this? Something's happening. Welcome, Drasil! Seaside Dole. Oh. Where things
things have taken a most unusual twist. Max's mysterious bit piece totally gives off a defensive vibe, but we won't know for sure till we see it in action. Interesting. Go, Drasil! You may have a powerful force at your control, but none is more powerful than my Dronzer. Oh, yeah! That's what I'm talking about! Boy, Max sure sent him for a ride! Air Dronzer has been cleared for takeoff! Oh. What goes up must come down, or so I thought! Yeah. Oh, yeah! yeah. <laughs> I told you he'd pull through! No, look! Oh, yeah! I wouldn't be so pleased if I were you. Why? Looks like things are really heating up down there! You've seen it all in this business. I wouldn't want to be in either of their shoes right now. For one thing, they'd be about 20 sizes too big. Oh, and Max's Beyblade crash landed outside the dish! Which unfortunately lands him in the loss column as well. Bad news for Max. But a big break for the defending champ. Max has been defeated! Kai has won! That's the very definition of a heartbreaker. Oh, poor Max. Truly an impressive match. Both these boys are going to go far. Hey, Kai! <laughs> Well, I guess you showed me. That was the best battle ever! What's your game? Oh, I'm serious. You were awesome out there. So I thought I'd come to congratulate you, Kai. Well, thanks, I guess. I'm going to have to keep my eye on that kid, now that he controls the power of a bit beast. <sighs> Great job, Jaseel. Next time we'll win for sure. Thanks for bringing him to me, Grandma. Huh? Tyson! You put up a great fight, Max. Sorry. I know I promised you. Mm-hmm. Hey, you almost flattened Kai. Too cool. <laughs> <laughs> so, I hereby declare you the champion. Right on! <laughs> Max has made such great friends here, and that makes him the real winner. an inspired idea, Tyson. What better way to blow off steam than to take a steam bath? Ah, I think a fish just bit me. Oh, I find that highly unlikely. Even if there was a type of fish that could survive the temperature of hot springs, the chances of it attacking you unprovoked are astronomically small. I see, sir. Unless, of course, it's a deadly hot water eel. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> <laughs> Can you believe I have my own bit beast now? It's so cool! Oh, cool? Hey, what's up? I think I heard something. Huh? I'll go see. <gasps> Ray! What's he doing? He has his Beyblade with him, so he must be training for our match. I heard he's got major power. Guess I'll find out myself when we meet in battle. <laughs> Until then, he's just another rung on the ladder that leads to the finals. After all, there can only be one champion. And may the best Beyblader win. Let it rip!
Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Seaside Stadium. It's time to make some noise for our next round, featuring this year's rookie sensation, Tyson, against the always top three. So don't you go anywhere. Man, I'm so ready for this. You get him, Tyson. Ha, it's in the bag. Has anyone seen Kenny around here? I thought he was going to help you. You're right, he was, but the last time I saw him was last night. Think he's okay? Oh, yeah, but what a drag he's not here, because he's supposed to trick out my Beyblade for the next round. Maybe I can help there. Hmm. <laughs> Wait a sec. What was I thinking? You boys can win this on your own. Yeah! Come on, Kenny. We've been working all night. A girl needs her beauty sleep, you know. Just a little longer, Dizzy. We've got to modify Tyson's Beyblade or Ray will be all over him. Boy, you sure are a charmer, aren't you? We've got to hurry. Okay, okay. Now, where were we? Oh, yeah. Try realigning the defensive ring, Chief. But we just tried that an hour ago. Don't you remember? Hey, who's the bit beast, huh? Okay. I'll try it. We're down to the semifinals at this year's Beyblade Qualifying Tournament. And, AJ, the next round is going to be a wild one. Correct the mundo, Brad, and check out Bay Stadium. They've gone back to the traditional setup for this round. It's time to introduce our contestants for this battle. So, if you will, give it up for Tyson! <laughs> wow, Tyson sure has some impressive stats. This kid has come out of nowhere to remain undefeated in the tournament. And if anyone has a shot at meeting Kai in the finals, it's Tyson. His opponent from parts unknown and one of the smoothest Beybladers around. Let's hear it for the one and only Ray! For some reason, Ray doesn't appear too stoked about this round. That's because with his bit beast, Ray is one chilly dude. <sighs> you can you feel the electricity? Uh, Brad, your microphone cord is frayed. Hey, what's up with the yawn? <sighs> oh, I didn't see you. Can we just get this over with? Oh, a wise guy, huh? Feast your eyes, kid. This is your doom. Hey, enough already. Ugh, he's getting me riled. Boy, oh boy, Ray is really getting under Tyson's skin. All part of his game plan, Brad. Ray sure is full of himself. I'll say. And I think he talks too much. <laughs> but he sure looks cool doing it. Right, guys, step into position. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're about to get busy. Oh, man, this doesn't look good. No sign of the chief. Looks like I'm on my own. Time to battle! I'll be okay. Besides, I've got the power of Dragoon on my side. It looks like they're all hooked up and ready to let it rip. Warriors on my mark! Three, two, one, go! Let it rip! Ray is one of those Bladers has always got a trick or two up his sleeve, and I can hardly wait to see what he's got for us today. Wow, did you see that? Oh, yeah. Calm down. This battle is far from over. Somehow, Tyson's Beyblade has completely vanished. Awesome! Oh, yeah? Looks like we can chalk one up to the Time Meister. I don't believe this. Me either. Ray has just topped himself. Oh, man. So, are you having fun yet? Huh? Hi, Chihuahua! Ray's got his Beyblade spinning counterclockwise! And now he's all over Tyson! Come on, Dragoon, keep going! This is wicked! Oh, I suppose the suffering has gone on long enough. Now! Trigger! It looks like it's all over for young Tyson, because I don't think anyone can match the power of Ray's Spit Beast. For once, I gotta agree with you. Tiger Claw attack! Ray's going in for the kill! Oh no! It's a no holds barred battle! I've never seen slamming and jamming like this! And there it is, folks! The fatal blow has been struck! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Impossible! 
possible. So Ray takes round one of the best of three semifinals. Dad, how did Ray get his Beyblade to disappear? It's more of an illusion than anything else, son. When the maximum rotation of your Beyblade hits a certain point, it becomes invisible to the naked eye. It's totaled. Oh. It's like it was ripped apart by a real tiger's claw. I don't know if I can match his bit. <sighs> Boring. Yeah. It's time to get back to the semi-final action. So far, Ray leads the best of three series one to nothing, and that puts our challenger Tyson in a hat. Where are you going? Is that Ray sneaking out of here? I do not have the time for this. He's far too inferior to stand a chance against me. Uh... Oh, and besides, his Beyblade is toast. According to the rules, unless he's able to fix it, he's disqualified from the match. Y you're kidding. He's right, kid. Unless you can get your Beyblade fixed, you forfeit. You can use whatever spare parts you want or make any changes, but you better hurry, or I'll have to declare Ray the winner. Spare parts? I don't have any. I guess you're out of luck. I think I'll take a little nap. Not so fast! What's going on down there? This isn't in my script. It's called being spontaneous, dude. Kenny! Did someone say spare parts? Oh man, you are a lifesaver. <laughs> okay, we'll take a small time out so Tyson can make a pit stop. Time to let the chief take care of business. Right, here you go. Okay. Good luck, kid. Come on, Kenny, you can do it. Yeah, I just hope there's enough time for the chief and Dizzy to get Tyson's Beyblade back into fighting form. They'll do it. They didn't come all this way to be disqualified. You can't beat him with just your Dragoon. He's too strong. Ah, here's the problem. Ray's trigger totally shattered your defense ring. So in order to properly defend against his extraordinary assaults, I'm going to accelerate your Beyblade's attack spin in the frontal area. That's not the problem. Yes, I know, but unless we increase the Dragoon's power attack, we might as well quit. We must avoid your defense ring from getting destroyed again. Oh, and I almost forgot to tell you about a little invention I brought. Huh? What? What are you talking about, Chief? Hmm? This is a new defense ring Dizzy designed. Let's see. It's made out of a special indestructible alloy. It will withstand virtually any attack you can think of, including that nasty little one Ray calls the Tiger Claw attack. So this is what you've been working on all night. Yeah. But there is something you should know. I haven't actually tested its balance because it would take far too long. However, it did work when Dizzy put it through simulation mode. Hey, don't yeah. worry. I have total faith in you, Chief. It'll work out fine. With just a little luck, we'll make the biggest Beyblade comeback ever. You're right. Here, take it and win the battle for both of us, Tyson. There's a reason we've come this far. And there's no going back, so go do some damage. You got it. After all your hard work, there's no way we can't bring Ray to his knees. Power of Dragoon! Ah, there you are. Okay, Ray, now explain. <sighs> I'm bored. The competition is so lame. Oh, really? Well, from the little I've seen of that Tyson, he looks fairly good. You know, I really don't want to do this. I could beat every one of them with my eyes closed, if I wanted to. Don't be too sure of yourself, Ray. You just might find a surprise or two. Now, get back out there and finish what you started. Hmm. 
Welcome back to Seaside Stadium. And Brad, during the break, Tyson managed to bring his Beyblade back from the dead. And it looks like we're set for the next round of semis. So if you two are ready, let's get it on. I said, is everybody out there ready? Ray, it's your turn to lose. Hey, if you don't mind, I'll let my Beyblade do the talking. Shooters, take your positions, please. Remember, folks, this is a best of three battle. More like a war. This is it, Drag. OK, Tyson, remember that there might be some bugs in your Beyblade, but don't worry about it. Just try and stay focused, all right? OK, Chief, the moment of truth is arrived. Let's cross our fingers and hope this baby works. Ready? I sure hope they fixed his Beyblade, or he's headed straight for disaster. Hey, I'm sure he and Kenny came up with a little something special. The second battle! In three, two, one! Let it rip! Battle Blade! Wow! Tyson's changed his shooting technique, and his Beyblade is just a blur! Let it rip! The Dragoon Attack! Oh no! The friction is causing it to overheat! I don't know what kind of game you're playing, but it won't work. The sparks are flying as this battle is literally starting to heat up! Tiger Claw Attack! This is sweet! Ray isn't gonna take any flat from the rookie! What's that? Yes, it's working! Dragoon counterattack! Maybe it's just me, but my doggone rheumatism's starting to flare up again. That's because there's a storm brewing down there, Gramps. Check it out! Freaky! It's Velocity created a tornado! Wow, look at that power! <gasps> I'm trying, but I can't see anything through this hurricane! Storm attack! In all my years of working up here in the broadcast booth, AJ, this is the wildest attack I've ever seen. Totally intense! I mean, a funnel cloud inside a stadium? What will they come up with next? Original. I'll give you high marks for that. But you're not in my league. Trigger transformation begin now! Oh man. The gloves are off on this one, Brad. Now what's going on? The beast is in the building! That's right, and you cannot beat it, because the tiger is indestructible! Unbelievable! Aha! Now I'll get a chance to see what kind of power he has. I just wish that Dizzy was here to see his bit piece. Finally! I've heard about the power of his trigger, and once I've witnessed its power, Ray will have lost his edge against me. Soon, they won't know what hit them when they fall prey to the power of my Dronzer. Come and get a taste of my Tiger Claw attack! Dragoon counter attack! Cross your legs and bite your lip, buddy, because it doesn't get any better than this! These two are throwing everything they've got at each other! Using run of the mill Beyblades, they'd have been trashed long ago. But I tell you what, Brad, both these guys came out to play hardball. And the crowd is really getting into this. Hey, Tyson, there's something important I forgot to tell you about. Defense ring isn't built for attacking. Great. Now you tell me. Come on, Dragoon, hang in there. On and there's no sign of it cooling off. This is the best battle I have ever seen. Go for it, Tyson! Check out Tyson's blade. It's coming back to life. Tyson's Beyblade is still picking up momentum. What in the world did Kenny do to that Beyblade? There's nothing but vapor trails down there. This is totally whack. What's it 
doing? Your little game is really starting to annoy me! The heat is on inside Seaside Stadium, and AJ, this round is up for grabs. What? Dragoon! Tiger Claw! Storm Attack! Huh? Where is this power coming from? Wait a minute. Do my eyes to see me or is Tyson's Dragoon on the attack? Dino, one of the blades just flew out of Bay Stadium. But which one? Uh, I, I can't tell from up here. We're just going to have to wait for the official announcement. And the other Bay Blade is spinning like there's no tomorrow. It's all over! And round two goes to Tyson! We did it! Yeah. Yeah. I knew you could do it, Tyson! Careful! <laughs> I don't know how his Beyblade survived, but... for some strange reason, that defense ring actually held up. Chief! <laughs> I don't care what anybody says. You really are a genius. Uh, it was nothing. Yes! Ah! <laughs> hey, what are you trying to kill us? Whatever you and the Chief did to your Beyblade was totally sweet. <laughs> <laughs> well, AJ, that was the most exhilarating experience of my life. It was a pretty wild ride. And it just goes to show you that even the underdog can score big and blading. Why did you let me lose the battle? <laughs> Maybe one day I'll understand. Tyson! Yeah? Ah, way to go. That was a good fight. I've never faced a challenger as strong as you. Ah, thanks. Tyson, you were great, and I mean that. Well, you're pretty amazing yourself, right? Huh, <laughs> really? That's a real compliment. Hey, cut it out. <laughs> <laughs> well, it looks like you won. But we're tied at one apiece. It's the best out of three, isn't that right? There's really no point to continue. I don't stack up against you. <laughs> no, this battle is over. So take your Dragoon into the finals. Oh, okay. Huh? Did he just forfeit the match? Hey, come back. We're not done yet. Yes, we are. What's up with that? Dunno. Oh, I just heard you threw in the towel. Well, I guess you heard right then. There's no point to continue. I don't have anything to prove. And you saw him. He beat me fair and square. But, uh, 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 so, I want to join the team. Oh. <laughs> the finals are now set! It's Tyson's Dragoon against Kai's Bronzer in the Beyblading Battle of the Century! Join us next time, folks, when we head into the finals with Kai facing the unknown upstart, Tyson. Until then, this is Brad Best saying so long from Seaside Stadium. Hey, you forgot to mention me! It doesn't matter anyway, we're off the air. Oh.